Hey everybody, legend has it that a young man calling himself this human fly is buried here in the pauper's field of Murfreesboro, Tennessee. Now what human flies would do y'all is that they would come up to a building like this and they would free climb up. And that's what this young man did in 1923. He came to Murfreesboro, he got about $320 and then he started to climb so he climbed to the first level he waved he climbed to the second level you can see there he waved then he climbed up to where you can see those clocks and he turned around he waved again then he went all the way up and he touched that arrow on the top of the courthouse above the cupola now he climbed back down to where the clocks were and i guess to give everybody a good show he decided to climb all the way back up and touch that arrow a second time ultimately this should not have been a big deal but it ended up being a big deal because it started to drizzle well when he climbed back down or started to climb back down he got just above the clocks there and he fell now unfortunately in that fall he actually did break his neck and he passed away but the problem was is that none of the townsfolk had any clue who this young man was at all so they put the story of his death in the newspaper and then they put the body at the local undertaker and the undertaker held on to him for a few days and actually had him up in front of a window for a day or so it's my understanding and it's my understanding that nobody ever came forward so they don't know who he is even today, and he's now buried in the pauper's field.